Hello everyone, I'm Sirnaif, and welcome to Resident Evil 7. I've already recorded about, uh, I think it was like 110 minutes of this uh, game. I screwed up my recording in OBS Studio and it didn't pick up my voice, so I'm using Audacity now, I've got everything sorted out, and I'm going ahead to start a new game. We're going to be doing normal difficulty. I'm not going to rush through anything, I'm going to take my time like I did before, I'm going to let you guys see everything, and I'm going to be quiet now, because it's cutscene. Just wanted to send a quick hello, and I love you. Hello. Oh, good news. I'm going to be coming home soon. Yay! Oh, I cannot wait to be done with this babysitting job and come home to my loving husband. I miss you. Oh, I got to get back to work. I love you, Ethan. I miss you so much. I'm sending tons of kisses. Bye bye. That's my webcam in the top left corner right there. On his little laptop. That's exactly what it looks like. Ethan. You were right. I did lie to you. I shouldn't have, but. All I can say is that if you get this. Stay away. Dun dun dun. Boo 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 boo. Hello? Hey, it's uh, it's Ethan. Oh hey, you all right? You just disappeared the other night. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm I'm good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead, she's alive. She, she's back. They found her? How? What happened? I don't know. Look, I don't know how, but she's back. She's back somehow. Maybe it's a prank. She wants me to come and get her. Where is she? Dolby. Dolby, Louisiana. Dude, it's been three years. I know, I know, but what if it is her? I have to find out what happened. Well, I don't know if you have to find out what happened, because I know what happened, and I don't like the outcome of this car trip we're taking. But I'm actually a pretty huge fan of Resident Evil series. I played 3, 4, 5, and 6. I beat all of them, and then I played, I think, just about every single one that came out on the Wii. But this game looks awesome, guys, and it's a lot of fun. This is the place. Yes, it is. Stupid flies. Now this gate's locked. Uh, the only... Okay, so yeah, this is the map. The gate's locked. There's a chain on it. There's no point in even going up to it. He literally walks up, shakes it, and then you have to go this way, so... Uh, was there anything in this car? I don't remember. Ah, yes, there was the uh, magazine. Sneak to a Louisiana ghost house. Oh, join us. Uh, those are the camera crew from the playable trailer. Ah, it flies again. Now, yeah, there's this guy. Character slows down. Okay, so it's not possible to catch up with him. That guy startled me so much when I first started this. Uh. Oh, I did not see this last time. Alright. What is it? Uh, whatever it is. It does, looks terrible. I overlooked that last time. See, maybe it's a good thing I'm replaying, because I apparently missed a couple things. Get up. So we're going to the because this is a lot of land. This has some guest house on because this is the guest house currently, which is what we're going in. Yeah, and then driver's license. Don't believe there's anything else. All right. Got her driver's license. Pull out a little pocket torch. There we go. 
And this is actually where it takes place in the playable trailer. I didn't play that uh, little demo or whatever, but I did uh, watch someone else play it. So let's see. Stairs don't work because we do need a fuse, but there is a VHS VHS uh, tape somewhere. After shut door, where was it? Where was the tape? It might have been in here, in the kitchen. Let's see. Oh no, it might have been up here. That's right, it's up here. Go ahead, save. I'm just gonna head and uh, save over my old save. I'm not gonna be playing on it, so I will be doing a full let's play of this game. So there's no point in having a second one. All right, now that we have the uh, chest or the VHS, we can go watch it. All right, let's go ahead and pop this in. Let's begin the show. This is the uh, three guys from the camera crew. Not, I say it's a camera crew, but they have their own little TV internet series thing. Who? What did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Speaking of which, make sure the sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. All right. These guys are a bundle of joy. This new guy? I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. I didn't notice this last time. Uh, if you press Plan. space or mouse, we you block. We through the inside first, then we shoot the intro. Right. Just like we always do. Yep. Just try to say the show's name this time, okay? Is a camera on right. my head? Tonight on Sewer Gator, another worthless fucking shit. Happy? Ecstatic. Because I don't have any type of camera in my hand, so I imagine it's just attached to my head. Oh well, it's locked. Come on, guys, get the door open. Are we rolling? Right, yes, go. we're rolling. <clears throat> yes, yeah, locked. I just tried that. Get out of the way. It's locked. Not anymore. You. So, why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? And I wouldn't say haunted. Fuck me. I was an anchor, you know. We can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. These guys just love working with each other. What's the story, Andre? Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The usual. The usual. How long it's you only say 20 missing people. Three years. <coughs> Clancy, get a shot of this. Let's make a great cutaway. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not, not Hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack Sorry and Margaret the Baker. And they were quiet, not back. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit! <sighs> no, I should have worn my good shoes. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't follow him. Glad I had my shots. Although, this would make a great backdrop. Andre, what do you think? Andre? He's clearly not in the room, dude. Andre! Andre! Clancy, you see where Andre went? Yeah, he went this way. Where is he? Unfucking believable. He went this way, my friend. This is the last time I worked with that guy. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. He was just trash talking before I went in the house. Now I'm a good cameraman all of a sudden. What 
you hear that? Nope, I didn't hear any noises. Andre? Where the fuck is he? Well, let's go in. Maybe we'll find out. Come on. Andre, where are you, man? Do, do, do. Come on. And yes, I know about this part already, but can I pull this or does he pull it? I don't remember. What the hell? That's right, he pulls it. You gotta be fucking kidding me. So he wants right, us to go down. We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. You can see Andre. You can see him. He's right there. You can see him, so there's no point even going down here, but no, the game wants us to go down here. What do you see? What is it? Oh, I was gonna see if I can't go the other way. Oh, that's still painful. Even looking at it a second time, that still looks painful. Hey buddy, that's someone walking in on you. They never stood a chance. All right. Jesus. Now we pull this. Hiya. This opens. And looky there. Bodies are gone. Do -do -do. Oh no, ladder. And flat. Well, we'll be going back this way now, will we? Damn it. Walk it off. We got a long trip to go for you to be grunting like this already. Good old neck deep water. Crawl under, there you go. Let's. I think there's something that pops up here. I just don't remember where it's at. Not right there. I remember that specifically popping up there. Ah, so it changes position. I went to the left side last time. That is Andre, I believe. So clearly he didn't make it. Uh, Clancy and the other guy are still somewhere. This game looks awesome. Uh, let's see, what's this? Oh yeah, these are all the people who've either been turned or died. Clancy? So Andre's dead, clearly. Clancy's L. I, I don't know what L means. Mia's unknown apparently right now. And here's Mia right now. We're gonna head. Let's break her out. Ha! Cha! Hello? Mia, thank God I found you. It's me, it's Ethan. Look at that hair. Ethan? Are you alright? You shouldn't be here. Yes, I know. What do you mean? You contacted me. No, no, I wouldn't. Did I? You did. Did anyone see you? Did he see you? Me? Who else is here? What the hell's going on? Daddy's coming. We need to go. Daddy? We need to go now! Still think Daddy's a weird name to be calling one of the guys. That's just my opinion. Where are you taking me? Someplace safe. Are you gonna tell me what's going on? Baby, you've been gone for three years. Three years? Yes, three years. Has it really been three years? Yes. That's why I'm telling you it's been three years because it's been that long. <laughs> Plenty of walkway. And she sticks her face against the board and drags it across. What? What is this place? Look. What'd they do to you? Not now. 
We need to get out of here first. I think it's this way. Well, let's go. Oh, I forgot how bad these spots were. Dude, I don't even want to know what these are. Let's go. Can't go past her. We gotta wait for her to lead us. Mia, we have to talk. That message you sent me. Not me. That wasn't me. But you did. I didn't. Okay, fine. Just tell me what's going on. I'm telling you everything that I know. Which is not a lot to go on. We have to go this way. Alright, let's go then. You know where you're going? Family used to bring me food through here. I remember. Well, then let's go. Oh, yeah, it's also fun to knock over cans when they're in piles. But I don't know if, uh, if I knock them over, will someone actually hear me? I'm too scared to test it out. Because there's this combat in this game, and there's also stealth parts where it's there. just better to sneak. It's there. Another door here. I'm sure of it. Oh, it's not here. It's gone. It's gone. We're gonna be a family now that you're here. It's a little creepy to say. Say, in fact, you were locked up. I'm sure of it. No, it looks like a wall there. Mia. We gotta get out of here. Yeah. No joke. Just stay here, all right? I'm gonna have a look around. <laughs> no, leave me alone! And she's gone. Up oh, the creepy stairwell. I forgot that opens for me. Thank you. Nothing in there. All right. Got the guest house map. Should be two medical things in here. I love the first aid in this game. It's really cool. Now comes the part with a little bit of combat. In just a minute after this part. Oh boy. I did terrible at this on my first try. Get to this door. The banging stops, the rain stops. And you can hear someone moaning and growling down here. Hello. And every step you take, you get slower, and then the door shuts. Hello, Mia. So creepy. Just as creepy as the first time. Time to resist. Time to resist. Ah, okay. Jeez, that poor left hand. Wait, wait. I don't know if I click or hold mouse one. I'm just gonna click. It worked last time. Ah, that poor left hand. Alright, that was scripted. You're losing your mind. I can hear her. You're losing your mind. I can feel her clawing her way back inside of me. Get out! Oof. Leave me alone! I've been bad. I've been reckless. Alrighty then. Just going to uh, pour that over my hand. For those who are wondering, that medicine actually uh, has a chemical in it that regrows cells. That's pretty awesome. That's why I like the uh, medical use in this game. I'm just going to 
what I'm trying to do, but you won't leave me alone. Alright, so here's the first bit of combat. Well, I screwed up. Ow. Uh, not good at this. Alright. I've never been good at melee combat games. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Whew. All right, glad that's over. I'm going to heal myself. There we go. Phone's ringing. I'm coming. Hello. You really shouldn't have come here. Yeah, I know. Who's this? Man, what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. There should be a way out through the attic. Hi, Zoe. Attic. Go there. Now. All right, all right. Oh, yeah, uh, she gets up. The infected on this one, and they're whew, they hard to kill. They are really hard to kill. Um, we need a fuse, and the fuse is actually just over here where we first came in. Now we have the bolt cutters; we can get it open. There we go, and boom! All right, got the fuse. Now we can activate the stairs. Forgot about that part. And there she goes. She goes up to the attic. We're going to install this fuse while she does that. There we go. I tried installing bolt cutters on it. There we go. Oh, and the inventory is very small. This is all you get. Weapons actually go in hot bar, so that makes it a little bit better. Besides the shotgun, the shotgun oh, takes up two. Okay. Forgot about this part. It's okay, it's me. I know you didn't mean to hurt me. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, this poor left hand gets it. Fucking hard. Oh. This poor left hand, it does not get a break. And she conveniently got the chainsaw from the attic too. Now, let's see how you feel. Oh, that poor left hand does not get a break. It's not amusing. It hurts. And for those who are wondering, there's nothing I can do about that that is completely scripted. Um, you can tell because once you lose these, lose your hand, there's no actual blood on the screen. Blood on the screen indicates you're hurt and you need to heal, so we won't die by just letting this happen or just walking around not using anything, so. But in here... Dun dun dun! The first pistol. Okay, fine. He's had enough. He's ready to fight. Now, that Zoe character said there's an escape up here, which is right there. But we're gonna come in here, and we are going to get this ammo. And when you reload with this gun, guys, with his hand the way it is. Just going back down. Because she's back. Reload with your little nub. I am responsible. Ah. 
Come on. No, you don't. You had that one coming. Where do I go? I forget. I've actually forgot. Oh. Welcome to the family, son. Ooh. So each part can be scripted differently. I killed her on another side of the room and he pops up in the window last time. This time he popped up at the door, so that's kind of cool. Oh boy. Now we're outside, guys. We're going to the main house, I believe. I actually don't know if Mia's dead or not. But we're gonna find out eventually, I guess. Black screen. Come on, don't you die on us now? You have work Oof. to do. Forgot about this part. Oof. <laughs> now I have no idea who that was. Just get my hand staple back, and then boom. The next part of the cutscene happens, so I haven't seen anything about the updated what's on my wrist and stuff. Now it's supper time, guys. Where am I? What the hell? Rise and shine, sleepyhead. It's time for supper. Who, who are all you people? Where's Mia? <laughs> that poor cockroach didn't stand a chance. Eat it. It's good. Dumb son bitch wasn't no good if it hit him. I don't even want to know what some of these things are. Get him, get him, get him, he's not eating it, Jack! He's not eating it! Get the hell up, Marguerite! I'm sorry. No boy. Oh, uh, he goes right for the mouth too. Oh. God damn it. I'll bet it's that cop again. God damn pigs. I'm coming back for you. Please don't come back. Oh, and she's alive. For those who are wondering, she, she is alive. There we go. One of the creepy parts is she is alive, and then if you... She just slowly turns to look at you. Here, there's a hatch that is locked. We lost all of our stuff. Everything's lost. Gun, ammo, any medical supplies you might have had, all gone. Some items uh, require lock picks, and I don't know how to get more than one lock pick. I've only ever had one, and I used it. So yeah, he comes back. Did you slip out before dinner was done? Try and block. Yeah. Ah, okay, make it past him. <laughs> all right, all right. I believe I got everything I needed. Now I just need to get back to that hatch and use the key. Oh, 
Oof. Alright, alright, alright. All right. If our character would run a bit faster, that would be nice. I found you. Yes, you did. I was never gone. You came to the wrong house, boy. Ah, forgot this part. Uh, this poor guy, he can't get a break. Ow. Okay, so you grab your own leg. Your own leg. And you get advanced or strong first aid. This one we can reattach the limbs. Now, I don't know if you can lose limbs in combat, guys, because this is the only time it's happened to me, but I think this is kind of cool. What the? Locked. No, 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 open, 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 open. No. Okay. Oof. All right. Come on, come back for you later. Still, things we're calling him daddy, but we'll we'll roll with it. And I can reopen that. Before I just kind of ran every time. I am super hurt. Don't know what antique coins are used for. Been collecting them. I do have a herb I can use. But I don't know how much health it actually records. Alright, we're at a save station here. I'm gonna put that in there. Grab this. You combine these two to make one of these. That fully heals you, basically. That poor left hand got chainsawed, stabbed with a knife, stabbed with a screwdriver, reattached, and lost my leg. This poor guy. There's a lock pick. Unlock that. Oh, I didn't know I could pick this up. So the lions are dead. But somehow, that girl is still calling me. But we're at the next save station, guys, so I'm going to call it episode here. Let me know what you guys thought about this game down in the comment section below. I'm actually having a blast, and I'm going to be doing a full Let's Play on this game. So, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.